because everybody else wanted to make treaties of pieces and friendship, right? Near the end of 1776. Treaties of pieces and friendships, man. And we're going to come back to this because it's going to play as we see the development of Tecumseh trying to gather the tribe the same way Dragon Canoe did. You know, he's raised up under him. Dragon Canoe had, you know, some success uniting the tribe, you know what I'm saying, from different different tribes, you know, indigenous tribes against the hijack. Tecumseh attempted the same thing, you know what I'm saying, and had had some success as well, man. But at the end of the day, he wasn't supported, man. At the end of the day, the tribes refused to tribe up because they wanted to sign treaties of peace and friendship. Look at the date, 1786. Seventeen eighty-six. Let's go to it. Seventeen eighty six, you were right in the middle of the Chickamauga Wars. Let me get my alkaline, man. It's about to be good, man. Hey, Shabbat Shalom. Hey, shout out to Five Eyes Ma for shouting out the Chickamauga. This this got us searching. And I'm glad you're asking about that flag because it gave us a reason to talk the Tao, my noggin, to take it on home and take our symbol back our mark, our covenant back, our con, our priesthood back. Con? Seventeen seventy six, we were right in the thick of things. And while we were over in the thick of things, just to let you know that they had help. Just for the body bag that these hijacks had help. In the midst of the Chickamauga War. Those that did what? Were separating from the greater body of these Nagas. Because the greater body of these Nagas. Wished to make peace with the hijacks near the end of 1776. What kind of peace? What kind of friendship? Treaty sealed by the Emperor of Morocco, June 23rd, 1786, and delivered to the American agent at Morocco. American agent is not uh, our people, it's the hijack, Monaga. This is the treaty between Morocco and the hijack. They'll tell you themselves that this is Morocco, right? So, okay, the Moor would say this is Morocco and they're making deals with the American agent. If this is Morocco and this is truly your land, you ain't gonna be making no deals for it. You know what you're gonna do? You're gonna fight to the death so that no hijack encroaches on your land. And when we're in the midst of fighting to the death because we have this land by covenant, we have this land by inheritance, they say, cool, let's get them out of here. Here's a chance to get those, those tribes and knock us out of here. Let's team up with the invader. Let's make a treaty with the invader. The Chickamauga said, nah, man, we don't wanna make no peace. The followers of Ski Gusta or Red Chief Dragon Canoe moved with him in the winter of 1776, 1777 down the Tennessee River away from the historic Overhill Cherokee towns relocated in a more isolated area. They established 11 new towns in order to gain distance from colonists encroachments. The frontier Americans associated Dragon Canoe and his band with the new town of Chickamauga Creek and began to refer to them as the Chickamaugas. 
So these frontier Americans, these hijacks started calling this tribe Chickamauga because they were near this creek. Five years later, the Chickamauga moved further west and southwest into present day Alabama. Oh yeah, and you see it. Alabama got the towel too, right? Established five largest settlements. They were then more commonly known as Lower Cherokee. This term was closely associated with the people of these five lower towns. So they're on the move, right? They're trying to get away. They're trying to get some type of, uh, you know what I'm saying, stability. They're establishing their cities. You know, they're reestablishing their towns, my nigga. And while they're in the midst of doing this, dead smack in the middle of us going through hell, these mofos are signing pieces and treaties. The emperor of Morocco is making a deal with the devil. And you want to come at us and more us and Islam us today as if Preston John was down with that shit, as if King David was down with that shit. The sultan was paying Preston John tribute. Don't try to put us into a black hole. We claim our tribe. There ain't no tribe called more. More is a general term for greatness. You want to be great, man? You want to you want to wear this flag, man? You want to wear this this covenant? You want to wear this promised land on you? You want your lot? The children of Lot want our lot too. Oh, we don't exist to you no more. Psalms 83, Confederacy. So the name of Israel is no more in remembrance, my noggin. Now we're more, huh? Saracens, huh? People of a promise. This is in 1452, right? Right before Colombo is supposed to be doing his thing and all this invasions happening. So we've been at war. But we at war against our own people first. The people that are covenanting our lot, which is why we keep the code, because Exodus 20 got us in code. And according to our code, thou shalt not covet his neighbor's things, right? But you're coveting our land. You're making treaties for it to help the invader whenever they need you. We weighing all and singular the premises with due meditation and noting that since we had formerly by other letters of ours granted among other things free and apple faculty to the Afrosay King Alfonso to invade, search out, capture, vanquish, and subdue all Saracens. A Saracen's head, right? The word Saracen was used in early centuries of the Roman Empire describing an Arab tribe from the Sinai Desert. Stop it. We're talking about lost tribes of Israel identity. Right? We're talking and roost. Wow. wow. Which means we're talking who? The kindred of the kings of Jerusalem? No, we're not talking no Arabs. No, we're not talking no Muslims. No, we're not talking Islam. No, we're not talking Morocco. We're talking Israel, my not. The tribes of Jacob, my not. The seed of David, my not. This ain't no play play. You know who the royals are. You know who the real regals are. The ones that got put to sleep in that Ruach Tardy Ma and we got popped off again by Hawaii. You know what it is. You can't moor us up to forever <laughs> in the black hole. You're going to have to give us, you know what I'm saying, uh, a little respect. Put put some more respect on our name and let the tribe of Andrews rock. Let the tribes of David rock, of Ephraim rock, because it's two sticks, huh? Ezekiel 37, love to my sister, Mac, Mac. And the word of Hawa came to me saying, Thou son of man, take you one stick, ride upon it for Judah and for the children of Israel, his companions. Then take another stick, ride upon it for Joseph, the stick of Ephraim and all the house of Israel, his companions, and join them to thee one stick, to another stick, cross sticks. 
that they may become one, my naga, in your hand. Don't you get it, man? This sign is about unity. This sign is about coming together. When they used it in their battle flag, they're talking about themselves being united and themselves coming together against you with their treaties of pieces and friendship. Nah, man, that's not what Hawaii's talking about. Join them for you, one to another, into one stick, that they may become one in your hand. And when the children of your people shall speak unto you, saying, Will thou not tell us what thou means by this? Say unto them, Thus says Hawa, behold, I will take the stick of Joseph, which is in the hand of Ephraim, and the tribes of Israel, his companions, and I will put them unto him together with the stick of Judah, make them one stick, and they shall be one in my hand, and the sticks wherein thou writest shall be in thy hand before their eyes. And I'm going to gather them on every side, bring them into their own land, man. Yeah, it's about the land. It's about the land rights, which is why you're just popping up out the ground on them, right? These are land rights, my Nagi. Yeah, this treaty over here is for the land rights, my Nagi. Uh, remember that Zillia S. Bay drop for the longitude and latitude right here in the promised land? Rainbow Coalition, whatever they are, Zodiac Rainbow thing. Their own land. Don't don't moor us up today as if we don't have our own land. Don't, don't try to graft yourself into this tree because of our Ruach Tarde Ma. I will make them one nation in the land. We're not talking about all the moors, my not.